Howdy, 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 y'all. Welcome back, welcome to you for Destiny, episode 4 of Soul Mask. I don't know why all of a sudden I forgot the name of the game. Um, so yeah, we've been having a lot of fun. Just I've been out gathering a few things while I was eating lunch. I think you know you're really into a game when it is 3 o'clock in the afternoon and you realize you have not eaten anything today. Whoopsies! I was like, why am I so shaky? But right now we need to open up some more things. Um, these take green crystals. Okay. Does it say where to get green crystals, or does it just say green crystals? No, it just says green crystals. We just gotta go out into the world. But I'm having so much fun here right now, but we'll get to it. Don't worry. Also, I really want to make wall torches and standing torches. What is that under? It says it's tech I don't know. It's not advanced carpentry, which I know we can't get to yet. Oh, we can do... um. Weapon modification now. And gear modification. Uh, premium potting. Water tank. And rain collector. Gotta go find clay. Drying technique. We need 18 for that. Kiln. We can go ahead and unlock that. Which is also going to need clay. And then leather gear. Which will give us the armor forging table. And some better gear. Which will be nice. Oh, we're in a 16 needed for that. Okay, fair enough. We can learn saddle crafting. Ooh, buddy, llama, alpaca, extended sea, wicker bat. Oh, okay. So, wall torch. Where are you? Oh, you're under furniture. Oh, we used all of our points. That's okay. We get plenty of them. So we were gonna make better tools and weapons. So let's put you in there. Um, you needed handles. I think I put those away on accident. Uh, let's see. Handles. Well, let's see everything we need so I can just go grab it all. Okay, we can already make... That's just... Oh, two beast bones and one handle. Let's make the axe. The pick. The scythe. And the butcher knife. Of course. We got durability mods. Of course, cotton. So we gotta go find cotton. And then we got bronze. Awesome, let's see what the animation is like. Okay, well, this is a step up in our tools, so I will happily take that. Didn't we open also? I think, oh, we have to make that weapons bench. We gotta go find clay. I don't see shovels, so I'm assuming clay is gonna be a pickaxe thing. Okay, our new axe is done. 2800 durability, and it's a fine weapon. <coughs> Excuse me. Let me get a sip of my spray. All of a sudden, my throat's all scratchy. Look at how awesome these tools look, though. Yeah, we gotta go find ore. We got a ton of stuff we need to go do, and I am really enjoying learning this game. So we can upgrade them. Uh, so we need craftsmen. Bench part one to upgrade this. And this is an excellent condition. So they do have different conditions. I was curious about that. So this is better than fine. So we're getting better as we're crafting, I presume. There's constantly people running around outside because I'm only about 500 meters from spawn. So. Everybody's been super pleasant. They've stopped by. said hello. Nobody's tried to murder me. Even though it's PvE, you still generally will get trolls that will attempt to kill you still. Why, I don't know, but I guess it tickles their fancy. So all we need is the butcher's knife now, and then we can unload, and daytime should be upon us soon. I also had to lay down because our morale was down to like 40. It's because you do get sleepy in the game. And that took about 10 minutes to get it back up to 100, but she gets out of bed on her own when she's done, so... I just walked away from my computer for a few minutes and went and got clothes off the line that we put up there yesterday because <laughs> I didn't get laundry done until like 4.30 last night and that was not enough time to dry. Okay, and that is an excellent. Okay, so our old stuff. We can pop you. Pop you. But now we're probably going to need bones to upgrade. But they have a lot more durability. I wonder if they... Give you more resources too. And then our axe. 
Okay, let's put everything away. Like I said, daytime should be pretty shortly. I think I want to spend the rest of these vines on making a ton more thick rope. Well, we're waiting for daytime anyway. We can be doing that as we're running around. Also, probably should make some more stone arrows. Just flint and branches. Uh, branches. Oh, we are very short on flint. So let's do... No, I don't want all of them, because... That will, uh... And then we gotta keep that stuff on us. Because it only takes one at a time. Alright, let's go see if we get anything more with these better tools, or if things are just faster. Just out of curiosity. I'll, no, you know what, let's do it with the stone, because we need flint and stone anyway. We're okay on wood, currently. And there are some stone notes right over yonder. Oh, we're hungry too, so let's go seven. And we're thirsty, so let's go E. Now we're all topped up. We're getting a lot more flint with this. Oh, I guess, okay, different rocks give you a higher amount of different things. Makes sense. Weaving proficiency is now level 37, which I believe is what they said was the cap in this playtest, but that might have been a, like a level 37 or something other than what I assume it to be. We have so much left to do before the playtest is over, I do not. I might even attempt to record this when Hubby's home later, because it's just I'm having too much fun with it. I want to get as much content done on it as I can while the playtest is open. Well, technically it's closed, but you know what I mean. Well, it's it's open to us and others. Grab a couple more of these. Sun should start coming up in about a minute. So we'll grab all these, go home, unload, and then get ready to venture out. Mining is level 11. That should be enough. Let's go ahead and grab some more of these while we're here. Fine. That's a lot of thatch. I wonder if there's a machine we can turn our thatch into vines, or our plant fibers into vines. We're overweighted. Where's encumbered? We're pulling a moon! <laughs> Let's slowly... Wander, uh, 120 of 115. So it looks like our character level up, or our weight is going up as we progress our character, which that's neat. Love when games allow for that. Okay, and now we can make wall torches. So, let's go torch. Oh no, we can't. Oh, because we needed one more point. That's right. Our awareness strength is 15 right now. Okay, let's unload. Oh, we got Calite. Clover stones, it can be used to make trinkets. Oh, we'll need that once we make our better armor. Oh, that can go, that can go, that can go. That can go over here in stones with flint. Oh yeah, you get a lot more bang for your buck with that. I, oh, no, 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 I need the stones back and branches to be able to make our arrows, right? Did we already make them? Oh no, flint. Stone arrows. They're a lot better than the wooden ones, so I do want to... Uh, no, not that many. Okay, three minutes on that. Let me get this crafted up and I'll bring y'all back. And we are back. Okay, we do have some more vines. I'll stack those and more tanning fluids, please. 
get this crafted up. I feel like this is one of those I'm going to have to put a lot of cuts in while I'm just doing the in-between crafting until we get us some um, people to craft things for us, or caregivers. I'm also curious how you go about in this game getting your thralls or caregivers or helpers, whatever you want to call them, companions. Every game calls them something different, so... Yeah, I just, I can't decide if I want to stay here or move. So I just think the best bet is going to be to start exploring and see what, if something else screams to us more. So, you know, these kind of games, I get excited to start building and start getting going. So I want to start plopping stuff down. But if we end up leaving, we'll destroy all the stuff that's here. I'm not going to leave it all sitting here. Okay, got about 35 seconds left. We can do it. Copy time. Oh, we have a cold front coming in on Sunday, and it's going to be like 10 degrees Monday and like 13 on Tuesday. So we spent all day yesterday winter prepping, so my back is jacked up from splitting all those logs. I spent like a half a quart to three quarters of a quart of wood yesterday for how well he was installing the potbelly stove. Because we had to take it out to get the AC installed. Oh, it's, it's like a whole mess, a whole thing. Let this last one happen, but having the potbelly stove where we have free heat versus... You know, thirty dollars in gas a day to heat the house is much better. Okay, so it is two rough leather per. So let's go rough leather, and we need twenty. We probably need more, but we're just gonna cook. Cook. We're gonna just make exactly what we need. So let me get this rough leather and this leather rope made, and then I'll bring y'all back. And welcome back. Okay, let's unload that. Uh, that and do we want I don't think we need to bring the wooden arrows no we'll unload that too so we got our water we got bandages we got a torch let's put the water there since it's not nighttime nuts are supposed to improve mood and so does the wild fruit so we'll keep some of those on us and let's head out uh, close the door oh it's like a foggy day let's see if we can't figure out clay I think we should go to this question mark but yeah, we'll see if we can't figure out clay. And the green crystals. Sorry, I was, trying, I was like, I know there's something else we're trying to figure out. Maybe we need to find lakes or rivers. I think like the clay's going to be by a lake or a river. So we can also go that way. Check that out. Actually, you know what? Let's just uh, create a shortcut. Go see if these are more ruins or if it's something of interest. Then we'll go see if we can find clay by a lake. Because if that's the case, then we might need to move. Which we're not going to do right now. Um, I have decided we're going to stay gonna stay where we are as long as we can. We'll have our like perma home once we have uh, like early access and we're not in a time crunch with the the play test let's go ahead and have our bow on the ready I know normally I would run everywhere but I can't what is this this looks different vines fiber and thatch and poison nope it's just a different looking plant fiber okay just seeing might just be the shadowing. But it didn't look like what we have at our house, so. I'd rather scythe it a couple times and see. Then what if it's something we needed and we missed it? Okay, so 156 meters. Yeah, let me know in the comments below if this is a game that you've been excited about. Oh, there, there. Uh, that's badness. Uh, let me get my spear. No, spear! I actually do like the spear. No, don't you dare! You know what, for right now I'm going to let it go. Only because I don't want to lose this one. Oh, 
that spear is pretty nice. Especially on those guys. Use guys. Let's go ahead and eat. I should bring back a little bit of health. I wanted to see what this was. Not that way. Very right back. And welcome back. Okay. Oh, let's go three. I actually do want to make some better armor, which is going to take a bunch of beast hide. So we'll kill what we can along the way. And let's actually have our spear on the ready. I did enjoy just some good damage. Ooh, these look different. Nope. Oh, herbs. Okay, yeah. Let's go ahead and grab... Oh. Oh, get your scythe. You might get more bang for your buck. Okay, five if you pick it by hand. And five if you scythe it. Okay, fair enough. I'm sure they're for something, though, so we're going to go ahead and grab what we see of them. That's all I see over here. Ancient ruins. Are you good people? Or are you bad people? Are you going to try and kill me? Yes, you are. Oh, I bet these are who we have to get to come do work for us. See, that's why I don't like the hammer. Too slow. Oh, we got knocked out. Nine. I'm going to need you to bandage faster. You know what? Let's go with bow and from a distance. Yeah, I bet this is... I don't know how we get him yet, but we'll figure it out when it's time. It's only level 7. We should be able to take it. Oh! That could have hurt. I'm going to need you to stay back. I guess once they get so far, they automatically turn around and go back. All you have to do is be nice. Yeah, you're up. They heal. Oh, she ain't playing games now. She's getting her her sword out. I have no stamina. Oh, come on. Just want to see if you have any super amazing awesome loot. That looks painful. <laughs> I gave you a new eyeball. Just gonna keep walking behind you and smacking you in the back of the head. Keep in mind, the game's not out yet. This will probably all be changed. Okay, so you dropped me some roasted potatoes. And some band-aids. And the other girl dropped me some band-aids. G. Thanks. Is this? Okay, that's part of the ruins. So these are what the abandoned ruins look like. So it looks like we can come here, though, to get us some thralls once we figure out nothing in the chest. That's unfortunate. Once we figure out how to do the... Like, getting our companions... Okay, let us now, uh, let's see, um, I want to go here, shortcut mark, and then delete. Okay, let's go see if we can't, oh, create shortcuts V, I don't know what I'm doing. 
let's head um to the water to see if clays buy bodies of water like small bodies of water i'm not really sure so only way we're gonna know is if we actually go out and look also we still gotta find green crystals i haven't found those yet either not too far away, but then we can go and cover the other question mark. You're definitely getting better with the bow. Sorry, buddy. I gotta make new clothing, though. somebody's base place or is that something in the game but there's a couple of base places over here i don't know how anybody can live in one that small there's so many workbenches needed unless you just came and did the beginner stuff yeah and then probably moved on once they got the grasp of it That looks like clay, so it looks like our suspicion is accurate on where to get clay. I love when games actually make sense like that. It's very refreshing. Oh my god, how can I be that bad at my shots? I think I got it that time. Man, my Horizon Zero Dawn character would be very upset with me if I was shooting that crappy in that game. Go back out. That very much looks like clay. Oh. What are you? Oh, it's like a bird. Beginner Hunter unlocked. Okay. There's the clay we need. Super helpful. It's not even that far from the house. They won't aggro you if you don't hit them first. Oh, there's a parrot. We can get that as a pet. Don't know how yet. We'll learn that later. Right now we are only here to collect clay so we can get some of the other machines and some stuff going. How heavy is clay? Um, we can go ahead and drop. Can I drop anything? Uh, discard. Discard. Uh, let's go ahead and eat one of those. Help improve our mood. Yeah, we're going to fill completely up on clay if we can. Just so we don't have to... I mean, it's... I think 97 clay for one thing we're trying to make. One bench. So the more we can carry home... I guess living by a clay... Fresh water and clay wouldn't be a bad plan. Hopefully it respawns quickly for anybody else that needs clay. Um, let's go ahead and see. Can we... Yes, we can. So, to get the wall torches. Oh, a guard facility. Archer tower, statue of God, ground spike, sticky trap, patrol stronghold. Oh, I want that. And then we got premium foods here, but I don't know that we're going to be able to make those. But you... Oh, we don't have any more points. I mean, fair enough. I think that's all the clay we're going to find at this place. How many did we end up with? 201. That's not horrible. If we want more, we'd have to go to a water source. But, what do we got up here? What here is this? Oh, it's a chick. Okay. Uh, let's see, there's probably some more right up there. What is our weight at? 
we got about 40 more pounds we can carry. So I'm thinking let's go home. Uh, see what we can craft up with the 200 that we got. At least be, get a start on it. And then we can go get some more later. So we still got to find the green crystals and some other stuff. But hey, at least we accomplished finding clay. Can I do this without dying? I sure can. My stomach might have jumped into my chest for a second, but we still did it. These look different. Fine, fiber and thatch. Nope. Uh, back to putting a weapon. Hello! Oh, I haven't found these yet. Maybe we can make a mushroom stew. Learning all sorts of new things. Imagine how that happens. You just go do Dora the Explorer. Oh, no, that's not the herbs. For a second I thought that was an herb plant, but it is not. This would be a good place to build. Nice open area. Oh, there's some herbs. evil beasts. I need my spear out in case they want to come poke at me. Okay, let me get back home. Let me get everything gathered that we're going to need, and I'll bring y'all back. And welcome back. Okay, so we didn't get 201 clay. We got 501 clay. So, man, that pick, the bone pick, huge difference. So, what do we need to make the potting table? We have everything we need, so let's get that crafted. We can also go ahead and make our building workshop. Let's get that crafted. And the earth kiln. We just need to grab flint. So, oh, we are moving on up. Let's get that crafted. Okay, that's going to take about six minutes. So, let's, uh, let me get all this crafted up and then I will bring y'all back. All right, our first table is done. The potting table. We might need to do another expansion. Oh, that's a door. I'm like, yeah, I probably shouldn't put it in front of the door, huh? I don't really use that door, but if I need to. Okay, let's put you right there. And let's see, we can make ceramic molds, bowls, cups. Okay, so let's do... And let's make you into ceramic molds. We'll make, like, all of them. I'll be right back. And welcome back. Okay, I went ahead and made a rainwater collector while I was waiting for everything else to craft. So let's get that placed now. Does that need to be placed on a foundation? Like I feel like we need a little patio area around here. Let's 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 do a little playing with this. Do I have not enough thatch on me? Okay, let's go grab some thatch and some thick rope. Thatch, and we got thick rope on us. Yeah. And let's do... Oh, I think we had some extra flooring, didn't we? Hold on, hold on. Hold the phone. Oh, we got two. Two is better than zero. And then we can use those pillars we had that were extra, too. And maybe even a roof piece or two. Uh, over here, please. Oh, right, I had it. Let's go there and under. I don't like how it looks like when it's floating. Uh, then let us grab the roof. Did I not grab it out? I'm not seeing it. Hold on. No, we did grab it. Am I just blind right now? I see there's no roofs. Yeah, I, 
don't see them in here at all, but they're not here anymore. Did we drop them on the floor? No. Okay. Weird. Okay, we gotta get this down too, though. Uh, this is our building. Let's put you there. Building workshop. Our earth kiln. Get you put there. And now we can make wind walls and all the good stuff, which, oh. Oh, there's our roost. I just clearly am blind. Oh, I cannot wait. Um, which I probably should do that instead of this, but this is the last episode I'm recording today. Uh, oh, that was good. But then I need you to go up. Oh, I... All in placement. Sometimes you gotta wiggle it. So if I go that way, I can probably go this way easier. It's not liking that. Gotta take out that window. It needs to be a wall. So what if we put a wall down and then we can take the wall out? Uh, let's see. Make one of those. Although if we do that, that might not work because then it's not going to collect rainwater because it's a covered patio. But I think the aesthetics of it, I do. Whoops. Uh-oh. And that won't go there because of that. Too close to the campfire. Oh. Really? Okay, so what if we instead... Let's go 9. Let's go Z... We go there. Let's dismantle this one. That gives it a little something, something, right? A little jazz. Okay, and let's put you maybe right out front so that it can collect our rainwater. Let's put you right there. Okay, now that should collect rainwater. When it rains. Oh, things are happening. And here we can make charcoal and lime. That's it right now. we got to open up more for that. But I am quite excited. So it is going to be a lot of planks. Both. Oh no, it's just one. So either planks or hardwood planks, one or the other. Oh, fantastic. Okay, we have to first science this. So let's throw some planks in here. I need to know if, uh, and some thick rope. If this is, I have to tear my house down, or can I put this on top of the thatch and it upgrades it? Very curious how the upgrades work. Because I definitely want to go with wood and not thatch. So Z, we want a wooden window wall. <gasps> oh, happy day. Okay, well, you know what I'm going to be doing for a while is sitting here making planks. Uh, let's go E. Make all those. Let me get these made up and I'll bring... Actually, I'm going to make a bunch of planks up and a bunch of walls and floors. And then I'll bring you back. And welcome back. Okay, it took about 45 minutes in real life to craft up 200 planks. Which I've already gone through all of. So in between this episode and the next, I'm going to have some grind to do. Just sitting in machines, crafting things up. Are we starving now? Let's get us some food and a drink. Okay, so we've got some foundations. I don't want to put the um, torches up until we... Oh, but these are floors, not foundations. Oh, if I take that out, is it going to bring the whole thing down? Hold on. It's for science. 
Oh, well, they made that really... Oh, my bed's gone. Okay, so pick up for... You place. Which, that's not too horrible. Actually, let's use the recycle button and see if we get some resources back. Cannot recycle damaged buildings. Oh, well, I don't really want to go through and fix them all just to turn around and recycle them. So we'll do everything that doesn't have stuff on it first. Yeah, I forgot we did floors, not foundations. Okay, so that's got to be moved. All that's got to be moved. We can probably do... Um, I think I'm going to keep that as thatch. Okay, so let's go nine. Let's go over here and... I don't know. Relocate. I'm just going to put you there for now. And then we can dismantle this one. Oh, that one took the wall out too. Interesting. The other ones didn't, but that one did. Huh. I mean, okay. I don't make the rules. Make sure this is fully on that, so that when we move this one and have to do all that. Uh, you go there. You go... There, and then we can... And then nine. See, that one didn't take it with it. Weird. Maybe it's just corners? Uh, let's get that out of our hand. Relocate you back over to here. And relocate you. Hey, it's going to be worth it. It's going to be prettier. Back over to there. Okay, and then we want to relocate you. And you. So I've never been a fan of the thatch. So let's go nine. We only have three left. Dismantle this one. Uh, yep, corners take... Okay. Fair enough. Let's relocate you. And then let's take this one. And a nine. Okay, now you can get put back. Still got some we gotta do, but... At least we gotta start on it. That's it. In between this episode and the next, I'll do some prep work. Super heavy, I know. Okay, so Z, we want a wooden door frame. Let's dismantle this door so that we can put a better door in. I'm not a real big fan of that gap. Do I have to do a root? No. Perfect. Okay, and then we'll grab this. And this. And then. That could be that. And this will be a window. You know me. You like lots of natural lighting. Okay, then that can just go over that. And we go back to our wall. And 
And we got window. From the window, down the wall, and a door. Let's get rid of this ugly thatch door. And put the better one in. And then Z. We want a wooden wall. It's a very smooth transition, so I do very much like that. Uh, going from thatch to wood. And back to the wall. Oh, that's a window. Window, window, and then, oops. Oh, the wrong buttons. Wall. Wall there, wall there, and then we need sloping wall. Then the other side goes there. Oh, and we got one over here too. Mantle. Okay, so that is all wood now. We got three walls left. Let's see, door, double door. I don't think we need these last three. Just making sure I didn't miss anything. No, we look golden. Probably make some wood actual, um... Oh no, don't favor that. Windows! Wood windows, that's what I was trying to say. Uh, thatch walls can go... Thatch roofs can go, because I do want to get that into wood also. So now we got our standing torches and our wall torches, so let's go nine. I'm going to put one there. I'm not sure we're going to put fuel in these. There. One in the center here. Then maybe one there. I could probably use one more over there. Then we got standing ones. Oh, these can't go on flooring. Fair enough. To go here and here. And then by the other door. Oh, I gotta put stairs in still too. Crap. I don't think we have enough planks to make another stair. Uh, let's uh, relocate. And let's just scoot you over to where you're even with that one. It's not nighttime, so I don't want to put fuel in them right now. Let's see what this looks like from a distance. We're getting there. It's coming along. It's got a little more form than it did. I'm, I'm liking it gonna end up looking a whole lot better soon uh, let's see we got 3300 waters in there so now we need more planks because we need what one two three four five seven more floors and then I really want to get rid of the thatch roof or at least the hmm yeah I think I do want to get rid of the thatch roof so let's see, we need, we got more hardwood than we have softwood. So let's do hardwood planks. And we're going to need a lot of them. So let's, 11 minutes. But this is a good time to say, Soul Mask. Y'all don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And as always, before we go, remember when gaming, have fun, play hard, but in real life, be the change you wish to see in the world. And I know it's before I go, but I've been streaming so much that before we go, just keep sticking into my head. <laughs> I'm having a lot of fun with this game. Thank y'all so much for your support on the series, and you have a great day. Laters.